Bianca King, na depressed pala siya pagkatapos ng shoulder surgery. Please subscribe to my channel. Sa post ng aktres na si Bianca King sa kanyang Instagram, inamin niya na na-misdiagnose siya dito sa Pilipinas. Pero buti na lang at nalaman ng doktor niya sa Sydney, Australia kung ano talaga ang problema. Ang nakalagay sa kanyang Instagram ay This is me starting from zero and gaining back my strength and flexibility. In July 2021, I had shoulder surgery called biceps tenodesis to fix a dislocating shoulder that was causing daily pain. I was misdiagnosed in the Philippines with a rotator cuff tear. Luckily, I did another MRI in Sydney and the diagnosis was joint instability and a split in my biceps anchor with calcetic tendonitis, inflammation and pain caused by the lost shoulder. I had the best doctors in Sydney who once worked with the Australian rugby team. They fixed my shoulder. My right arm had muscle atrophy and had no strength to even lift a pot. After six months of psychotherapy to mobilize the stiff shoulder, I was ready to start building muscle again. I started working with Rebel With Us in February 2021 and the results are astonishing. Understanding of physiology and care for my injury made the difference. Our consistent workouts helped me to feel strong all over. With my shoulder 90% back to normal and my entire build looking more tuned than ever. All the in the comfort of my own home with minimal equipment. I was in so much pain after surgery and sleep on a stack of 5 pillows for 3 months. I felt so weak and skinny. I was depressed being isolated at home during the peak of the pandemic, not being able to bat myself properly or cook my own food, mostly laying in bed feeling down and crying to my friends on the phone. I had to stop yoga for over a year. Now, I feel almost back to normal but extremely grateful for having gone through that horrifying experience of joint surgery. And the best part of it, all was my bond with my husband became stronger as he stepped up to take care of me when I couldn't take care of myself. 